Good morning or afternoon, whatever time you people are viewing this video, my name is Transverse and today I'm going to give my opinion on what Nexon can do to spark up common arms and maybe revive it. <clears throat> First off, due to the reboot update, common arms has made every single weapon overpriced as fuck. In order to make it more balanced, I would just reset the way we bought GP and make NX, well NX and GP for GP. And if they really want to make NX for GP, they should just leave the GP weapons alone and put the NX guns in the rental system for GP and make them overpriced and leave it like that so GP only players can have the ability to buy GP guns at the normal price. <clears throat> Second, I think this EXP is just fine, but the rate of the GP is so low. In order to rent one gun now, I have to play for about an hour. And each game only gives me 200, 300 GP. And I know my score of 29 to like 11 should be giving me a lot more than that. Third, alright, I want you all to really listen to this idea. It's kind of something I don't think Nexon will do, but it's original. I think Nexon should make a hacking server. What I mean by this is not make hacks, but make a server such as regulars or super soldiers or veterans or clan war server and call it like noobs server or something. And in that server, each game has boxes that looks like the super soldiers boxes that gives you stuff, you know. But instead in this server, instead of giving you like super speed or something give them fly hacks give them I don't know aimbot um, no recoil this would probably reduce the likelihood of other players buying VIP and going on regular and trolling when they could do it simply for free on the noob server and you know yeah fourth they should host a lot more events what the hell happened to Scorpions vs. Spiders. I swear, I thought, I thought that was yearly. Because uh, I did play this in 2011. I'm not sure if it was then, but I do remember something like this. But now, like, there's there's nothing, you know. I just want Nexon to do something that all the players would like. That involves us having to fight off each other like a competition. That involves two sides. Fifth, make more GP perms. I swear I remember that before the reboot update, the dev team whatever promised freaking GP perms and all we got in return was some just terrible free weapons and the rental system which like I said is overpriced. <clears throat> 6. Add skins that we can buy and add into our guns. Let players submit them in through the forums and add it into the game so we can buy it with GP. Kind of like the Black Dragon TRG skin. Like, we can add flames to that L9 for 500 GP for one day. I, I mean, I would use the L9 more because it would look badass, you know? 7. <clears throat> Please, just listen to the players. Common arms may be dying, but we still exist and just want to be heard. And 8. Actually get game moderators that play the game and know what's going on. 9. Get more interactive with us. On the forums, ask us what we want in the next update and what, you know, what they should bring out that's new. 10. Have you guys, like, I'm not sure if Nexon's ever done the ad on YouTube, but, I mean, if they haven't, I think they should consider so new people can see, because... So many people watch YouTube and they might consider CA at least more than a thousand, I'm sure. And you know, there's new people, you know, that we would play with. And in the long run, it might be good for CA. I'm not sure how it works, but it, they might make profit out of it. I'm not sure, but it's just something they could give a try at. 11. Host. They should host like competitively themselves. Why? Are, are the players hosting it and why are the players giving out the rewards for the game when the people who made the game should be doing that there's no logic in that they should host also more giveaways kind of like the one of the drawing one or the 
montage one. And instead of Nexon deciding, let the players decide who did best. And that because I remember the montage one, the one that won, the first place who won the Astro headphones, it was probably just the, the shittiest montage I've ever just seen in my whole life. So just, you know, instead of next on this, I make the players decide if they decide to do this. <clears throat> Twelve. I think Nexon should actually go on YouTube and see videos of the Commodore Arms players that play the game and give opinions on issues and what Nexon should do instead of themselves just thinking what they should do and like pressuring themselves when it's so easy to just go on YouTube and like UCD or Shadow Grammar like always giving out ideas on what Nexon could do and you know if Nexon did that you know it might be more balanced the game. 13. Instead of focusing on adding shitty guns or giving out free guns that no one uses, try fixing the lag. 14. Change how the kill streak sounds and looks. What I mean, instead of having the double kill, multi kill, ultra kill, fantastic, unbelievable, and unbelievable plus, add something like double kill, trio kill, godly, holy fuck. Haxer and then like unbelievable plus could be like good game banned Because that is true sometimes Nexon bans for abnormal stats when you get like above um, Like some unrealistic um that you don't get normally 15 I Would like it if Nexon adds more quickscope maps kind of like junk fleet, but they don't have to It's just something that the sniping community of commoners would like 16 just stop banning pro players. I mean, there's this one guy that got an unbelievable plus 20 and he just got instantly banned. Like, he wasn't even hacking. And, because it's, it's just so obvious he wasn't hacking. He missed so much. So come on, next one. Just, some people get lucky and they get it, so you shouldn't ban them for that. 17. The zombie range in Quar is just fascinating. Please fix it. 18. We all know you're running out of cards to play. How about you ask us what goes next? Because then it's more likely that you'll get something right. Even though you're probably going to mess something up like always. 19. This is an idea I I kind of came up with. I, I don't know. I saw it in some game and I thought it would go good in combat arms. They should add a 1v1 ladder, a 2v2 ladder, and a 3v3 ladder. What I mean with this is something like Clan War, but it is only teams of 1, like solo, dual, or triple. 1, 2, or 3 players. And in each ladder, those 3 categories, you have to fight other teams, but like, you know, like a 1v1. And it has kind of has to be like a sniper only 1v1 but they have to agree on the same guns and stuff but it's kind of like CW but the thing is at the end of like every month the one like the top like the top for like the first player in each three categories will get a reward and like shout it out in front of Comet Arms like the homepage and I think it would just be something new that they should give a try 20 Alright, I think this is a good one. Okay, you all, know, you all know how we have guts, right? Alright, I had this crazy idea when I woke up. How about you give them levels? Every time we buy a gun, and like right now, we all have level 0. And for each kills we get with that gun, we get level 1, and then level 2. And in order to get level 3, we have to kill a GM with it at least 5 times. Making it somewhat rare to see a level 3. And for each level in stats... No, you know what? This is even better. For each like level up, they should let us customize the stats. Imagine how fun that could be for us. We could control the recoil, we could control like damage, like for like level 0 we start off with 3 points, for level 1 we get another 2 points, 
For level 2, we get 3 points again. And for level 3, we get 6 points. And each of those points, like, it's 1 point to upgrade, like, the accuracy or the rate of fire or the damage or one point to reduce one recoil or something. I just think that would be kind of fun to play around with and I I would be willing to actually do that because, you know, it's, it's kind of like an RPG game if you think about it. And I know Nexon's pretty good in the RPG style so they could try that if they wanted. <clears throat> 21. I'm pretty sure I've already said this but improve the damn GP rates. That's really all I have to give today, but just, I know this game is dying, but I just kind of want it to be revived because I've met so many great people throughout this game, and you know, it would just be kind of sad to see the game just die off. And you know, some, some YouTubers also kind of really like to play this game, and just, it would disappoint them if you just... You know, just died because you didn't give the best effort that you could have and just listen to yourselves instead of other players who, who, who play the game on a daily basis. So yeah, that's all guys. Have a great day. Subscribe, like, and comment. And let Nexon know that they should listen to us. And please, please share this with them. And goodbye.